Hi guys. There's been quite a long time since I've gone on vacation, right? Uh, I took some time to go back and uh, record the class because I was, well, I took some vacation indeed, but I got really swamped uh, when the classes restarted at the school I worked for. Uh, but now I'm here back and uh, restarting all the classes. Well, today I'm going to talk about all the causes. I know that some people have some problems with this topic, but it's really simple and uh, doesn't require like a lot of attention, only uh, contextualization, okay? But before I say a thing here, first of all, if God we have one, okay? Because we have three types of if clauses, clause one, two, and three. Today I'm going to talk about clause one. If clauses one deal with real possibilities, deal with that, real possibilities, how? Let's see. Let's have a sentence here. If you study hard, you will learn. See, this if clause here, if you study hard, is my condition. If I study hard, what, what is my result? We'll learn. So, if my condition happens the way I want, my result is going to be this. So, if, I, if you study hard, you will learn. Okay? Um, let's have another example. If you're tired, rest a little. Something more like straight to the point. Okay? If you are tired, rest a little. Something simple and objective. And objective. If you're tired, rest a little. If I'm sleepy, go to bed. Simple that. Okay? Uh. Okay, let's take a look at this one. He can go to the party if he has the money. Oh, is it possible to invert the sentences? Yes, it is. You don't need to keep only if and a sentence. You can put the opposite as well. So he can go to the party if he has the money. Okay? Also, another real possibility. Because my condition to go to the party is having the money. If I don't have the money, I cannot go to the party. See how it is. Okay? Uh, one thing that you need to pay attention is this. Let's pay attention in there. Uh, always the if clause. If we use some sentence in the simple present. Okay? This is grammatically speaking now. So if plus simple present. And my results, I will use something like will or can or uh, imperative, okay? Something like that. Sometimes I can use should, to, okay? Something like this. Like here, the simple, the if simple present, my condition. And this sentence is my result. See guys, if clause is not complicated. I have a condition and I have a result. This result is totally dependent on my condition. Okay? So guys, um, this is it for if clause 1. I would really 
appreciate for your patience because I've been away for a long time, but I'm back on my glasses. Okay, guys, thank you very much. Uh, we're here in a new year 2011. I know life is February already, but as I didn't record classes since the beginning of the year, so I wish you guys uh, a new Happy New Year 2011. You're there, and I study hard, okay? Thank you, guys.